people who live in a world where the problem is not that they don't have enough data, it's that they actually have too much. And what they really want is understanding and meaning from that data. At Automated Insights, our mission is to help make the world's data more understandable. We all, in some aspects, are storytellers. We all have a story to tell. What we're doing here at Automated Insights is creating a tool that allows users to take that data and transform it into a narrative that they want to communicate. It wasn't so long ago that people wrote everything down on a ledger. And then we came up with spreadsheets. That if you give somebody a spreadsheet and say, here's all of your data, They'll look at you and say, what does that mean? The areas where we're seeing machine learning and artificial intelligence being really effective are our areas where we're able to make humans perform better um, than they were before. So what would have maybe taken them a few days now can only take them a few hours. Our product, Wordsmith, is a natural language generation platform. So it's the technology that we use to turn structured data into written text. Wordsmith gives you the ability to connect to data wherever it lives, and then design how you want to transform that data into language. And then from there, Wordsmith takes over and can do all of that transformation automatically. Wordsmith allows data analysts to embed domain-specific language. In real estate, for instance, there may be one certain metric that's very important, uh, which would be different than in sales or healthcare or in finance. You have complete control over the tone, the analysis, what you talk about, and what language that you use. We actually have customers publishing in over 20 languages. So East Asian languages, European languages, the whole wide range of things that a global company would want to write in. Every quarter, we publish 4,000 stories directly to the AP wire about what's happening with companies. We take structured data about the earnings of those companies and turn it into an actual journalistic newspaper article that they publish. And then those cub reporters can move on to more interesting analysis rather than doing the very basic computational things that a computer can do really well. Looking in a rear view mirror doesn't really cut it anymore. You gotta be looking more in real time, but you can't do it if it's just raw data coming at you. If somebody can just tell you what it means, now you have it. Now you can talk about what are we gonna do about it? Why is it happening? And now we're having a much more valuable discussion with everybody on the same page.